Guys, my mom is also in the red and orange tutorial. Got Goblin, one, and enter the party. Bye, Enzo, and bye, Daddy. Right, let's go in this way. The Hobbit, the staff, a long stick used in walking, adventure, somewhere to do something exciting, a burglar, someone who steals things, faint. Fall down after something scary, a treasure, money or jewels. Summary. Gandalf the wizard visits Bilbo Baggins. Later, 13 dwarves come to Bilbo's house. They want Bilbo to come to them on it with them on an adventure. Quote from the original. In a hole in the ground there lived a hobbit, not a nasty dirty wet hole filled with the ends of worms or oozy smell. Nor yet a dry, bare, sandy hole with nothing in it to sit down on or eat. It was a hobbit hole, and that means comfort. It was a nice day. Bilbo Baggins sat outside his hobbit hole, relaxing. An old man with a long beard and a staff walked up to him. I'm Gandalf, the man said. Gandalf, so Bilbo. You used to make fireworks for us. <laughs> so you remember me, Gandalf said. I am here to invite you on an adventure. Bilbo shook his head. I do not like adventures. They make you late for dinner. No thank you. Gandalf said, I will come back tomorrow and we could have tea. So the next day when Bilbo heard a knock on the door, he thought it was Gandalf. But when he opened the door, he got a surprise. A dwarf named Balwin said hello and came inside Bilbo's house. More and more dwarves came. They all came inside and they ate at Bilbo's food. Finally, Gandalf came with the dwarf's leader, Thorwin. Bilbo was very upset. After dinner, Gandalf explained why they were at Bilbo's house. Long ago, a dragon named Smog had attacked the dwarves. The dragon attacked their home and made them all run away. Gandalf had met a dwarf named Thor. Thor had a special key. It would let dwarves back inside their home. They could get their treasure back from the dragon. Bilbo will be your burglar, said Gandalf to the dwarves. He will sneak into the mountain and help you kill the dragon. This scared Bilbo very badly. He yelled, struck by lightning, and fainted. After he woke up, Bilbo heard Thorn and the dwarves singing. They were singing about their lost treasure. Bilbo imagined what it was like when the dragon attacked Bilbo. Imagine the dragon coming to the dwarves' home. Bilbo fell asleep listening to Thor sing. And all night long, he had strange dreams. That and...